Come. A boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Derlin was some sort of... Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Walls being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Derlin's. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We can prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. Looks like your axe is due for some attention.
Whatever you need. This axe just keeps getting stronger. By the way, if you're headed to the mining rigs in the bay, could you bring me any slag you find? I could use the material for my crafting. Bloody drogger holes! We've got to clear out all the undead bastards! <laughs> No, it's still here. What? The island near the geyser. We need to get the key from it and unlock this door. We need... I need... to set right a very old wrong. What's behind the door? A prisoner. Of sorts. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke oh, above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. to explore here. Kind of nice to be out of Midgard for a bit, huh? Up above! 
Materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfheim ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it.
How did these rigs come to be? I had them built to harvest ore for armaments. Essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. So we're going to Durland's? Makes sense. We could always explore those mining rigs later. <laughs> Demir, how many stories have you told about Odin and Thor? And all the bad things they've done? Let's see how many we can remember. Seems like Father could use... Memory refreshed. My memory of them requires no refreshment. They invaded our home. Yeah, but I'm talking about history. All the other people they've hurt. Let's see. Okay. There was Thalmor, the stonemason. Aye. He quarreled with his son. Went into the night to find him. Found Thor instead. And there was Thalmor's son, Grimthor. Who built the walls of Asgard. And whispered something of importance to Freya before his betrayal and assassination. Enough. We will continue later.
So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Or they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting enough. This is the safety office? Well, the sign a hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. We're looking for Durlin? You have an appointment? Uh, no. Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> Here to collect on something, pal. Think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Astrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <laughs> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get... You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Faye is dead. Best of them all. One's left alive after pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfine from the ace here. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Like this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the old father's given name and, uh, uh, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Hey, this isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Right side, it's coming! Right side! 
Okay, as I was saying, I think Derlin wrote my direction. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smelled him? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Ah. Tyr! Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. I thought I said... He's passing through. Huh. Dylan's map points to a mine. I see a mountain back on the other side of his office. Maybe we should head that way. No harm in exploring a bit. Passing through. Again. Are you testing me? Get out!
This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. to use this. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. See another train. Let's look for a way to get over there. You know, maybe finding Tyr is our best protection. It seemed like Odin really didn't want us to find it. Once Tyr's free and can be God of War again. Odin won't have time to worry about us. If that is his war to fight, he may have it. One Raven down.
looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. A bomb? Deactivated, but yes. Likely one belonging to Bari, the Dwarf, builder of the Great Hall, Lua. Rock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. Special equipment to use this. <laughs> <laughs> 